There are three main types of rock which are visible on the Earth's surface, magmatic, sedimentary and metamorphic. We are going to do some basic triage and see if we can classify two rock samples. This first sample is a good size and has fresh surfaces. It feels light. Now the visual inspection. With the naked eye I can see the rock is light colored, whitish and homogeneous. There is no structure and I can't see any minerals. It has broken along conchoidal fractures. It feels smooth. Let's get a closer look under the hand lens. I cannot see any additional features using a hand lens. It really is homogeneous. When I try to scratch steel with it, the rock leaves a white streak. However, when I wipe it away, there is no mark. This tells us that the rock is less hard than steel. It could be limestone, which is made from calcium carbonate. Calcium carbonate reacts with strong acid, so let's test our sample. Our rock fizzes on contact with hydrochloric acid, therefore it must be made of calcium carbonate. My second sample is also a good size and has fresh surfaces. It feels light. With the naked eye I can see the rock is light colored, greyish, but not homogeneous at all. It includes clasts, which are elongated, curved and very thin centimeter or millimeter sized. These are in the shape of shells, which have been more or less broken. The matrix surrounding them is darker and very fine grained. Let's check its hardness. Again we see that the sample is softer than steel. The shell shaped clasts, combined with a softness, hint at calcium carbonate. So we can repeat the acid test. It fizzes that confirms the presence of calcium carbonate. Our first sample is a homogeneous calcium carbonate based rock which tells us that it originated with lime mud precipitating onto the bottom of a lake or sea. Our second sample also originated in a body of water but with an accumulation of biogenic materials such as shell fragments and lime mud. Both rocks are sedimentary and limestone.